Wapakoneta and Shawnee also postponed from yesterday. Game also moved to Harmon Field. No score in the first quarter. Shawnee with it first. Griffin Heights out of the gun. He's brought down in the backfield by Corey Crawford. That's a big sack. Indians go three and out. So Wapak offense on the field. Hand off to Cameron Locke. What a day he had up the middle and into the end zone. One of three touchdowns. He finished with 80 yards rushing. Redskins lead at 7-0. Ensuing Shawnee possession. Heights gets picked off by Drew Vol. And he's knocked out of bounds on the near sideline. Turnover has the Redskins in the red zone, and they make a count. Jared Cockerell plows three yards up the gut into the end zone. 14-0 Wapak. Indians trying to get on the board. Hand off to Zachary Casey. He picks up six. The ball comes out. It's recovered by Dylan Askins, and he picks up a few more yards for an Indians first down. Then Ray Manley in at quarterback. Pass is deflected. Somehow still caught by Jalen Bagley, but the drive would stall, forcing a punt. Later in the quarter, Wapak facing a fourth and 10 on the Shawnee 40. Aaron Huffman pass complete to Ethan Good on the far side, and it's good for a first down later in the drive. First play of the second quarter now. Huffman on the play action. He hits Cole Mer Colt Miracle in the end zone. Nine. Nice yard. Nice catch right there for six more. Wapakoneta cruises to a big 38-6 Western Buckeye League win. That's 20 straight regular season wins for the Redskins and 70 straight regular season wins for head coach Travis Moore. Wow.